Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to go over how to draw a polygon. A uh, pretty basic function, but it'll make your CAD life a lot easier. So, let's get into it. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do when we want to draw a polygon is we need to find the polygon. So to find the polygon, we're going to go up to the Draw tab, or the Draw box, underneath the Home tab. And where the rectangle is, there is a little um, selection arrow that you can click down on. And it is right there. So it's right under the rectangle is. We're going to left click on polygon. And then we're going to bring that down. Now before it asks you to specify a start point or a center point. It's going to ask you how many sides do you want to make that polygon. So for this specific example. We're going to do a five sided polygon. And right here we're going to type in five. Then press the enter key. And now it's going to ask us to specify the center of the polygon. So this is where we're going to find a place to put the polygon. So, for this example, we're going to place it right here. Left hand click. Now, this next thing is pretty important. You're going to get two options. One's going to be inscribed in a circle. The other one's going to be circumscribed about circle. So, the inscribed in a circle means that the polygon will fit inside a specific circle. So, when you're giving a radius, the point of each part of the polygon will touch the outer circumference of the circle. Circumscribed about a circle means that the circle will fit inside your polygon. So when that happens, your circle will be tangent to the lines or edges on the polygon. So your edges or lines will go to the radius of the circle. So for this example, we're going to click inscribed in circle. And we are going to make that a 20 foot radius. Okay, so as you can see, we have a 20 foot radius polygon right there. And this is a five-sided polygon or a pentagon. But let's do one where we're circumscribed about the circle. So where the polygon will actually fit outside the circle and the circle will fit inside. So we're going to go back up. Left-hand click. Bring that over here. And five sides. Enter. We'll specify the first point there. And again, right down here, we're going to click circumscribed about circle. And then we're going to say 20 feet. So enter. And as you can see, this polygon is a lot, well, not a lot, but it is bigger than the other one. So the bigger one is the circumscribed about circle, and the smaller one is inscribed in the circle. So to kind of give you a field of reference and a kind of understanding of the circle itself, let's move this one back out here. And let's draw a circle with a 20 foot radius. So the circle with the 20 foot radius, we're gonna move it, enter that, and as you can see, the inscribed in the circle, all the points touch the radius, and the circumscribed about the circle, all of the lines of the polygon are tangent to that circle, and those lines are gonna be where your radius falls. All right, so that's going to wrap up the video. Uh, thank you, everyone, for watching. If you have a better way of doing anything or other tips and tricks, please leave them in the comment section. And as always, like, comment, subscribe. And I hope everyone has a fantastic rest of their day.